Uh, hey, what's going on, guys? It's Sam to see you here, and, um, don't question how I crossed that gate with Goron. Just don't question a thing, okay? Anyways, this time we're going to Great Bay. Actually, um, I'm gonna need to equip a few sticks here. This first section. That's not a Deku stick, what the fuck? Did my mind- did you just experience my mind? Brain fart? I think he just did. There's this man in the ocean. And he's like a pixel, I don't see, but you can see him. Uh, somebody, uh, please, get me to shore. So, I'm actually holding the A button to grab, and there's no animation for it, it's just the link swimming into, the, into his ass. In the 3DS version, they um, added a push of animation, they probably should. But... The fact that he can limp that long is just crazy. Anyways, I lied. We don't need Deku Stakes for what I was about to do, but, well, it's quicker if I do this first. So just like we did with... Just like we did with Dharmani, we play a song of healing to heal him. Or rather, heal him forever. Right up. We get the Zora mask. Another great mask. Made my farewell song and my great companion. You'd help the singer. Meanwhile, Link just dead stares and nothing. Mm. 
we build a grave. Just like our money is just, just a tutorial for um, how to play as him. And you put the sword mask, and also. And uh, now we need to get this. Um, oh, I wonder what the fish can do. Yeah, he makes swimming much better. I can come back here whenever I want. Um, but first things first, I actually don't want to be in um, in Great Bay because technically this is the third area of this game. But you can actually do um, a lot of things out of order in Majora's Mask. Um, specifically saying that, like, you don't need to beat temples. Like, as long as you have the right tools, you can go wherever you want. And we have all the tools to go to the fourth, um, area. And, obviously, you need to beat every dungeon to go beat the final boss, but you can do it in pretty much any order you like. So... No, I didn't want to do that. I wanted the upgrade. Um... I don't actually want to be in Great Bay yet. I actually want to go to um, the fourth area of the economy. Bunny hood on the uh, weapon. possible to get here with that Epona, but it's going to require a lot of uh, Goron bomb jumps. So much so that I'm actually probably just going to get some more bombs real quick. Many of the bomb shoes. That's what they're actually called, by the way. There's an item in enemy. Oh. 
that's not nearly close enough. That is actually close enough. I was wrong. You hate the second game. They usually should be trivial with Kona, but... Um, we have to do this the hard way. Now that we're... Um, now that I missed Romani Ranch's event on day one, we have to do everything the hard way. I could have just equipped the bunny hood, I'm dumb. Here's Dompe. We're gonna get into uh, what he does in a little bit. And, um. Uh. Dompe's interesting, to say the least. I forgot to equip the Ocarina. Um. You need to play Sonata of Awakening to awaken this guy because he's asleep. Switch to Boron. You choose Beeping Flame, choose Zelda Fashion. Guy, you have a giant punch. Alright, I'm failing this. Yeah, I failed. You could not even catch me. That that means that must be all the strength. I've never actually failed that before, so I don't know what to do exactly. I think I just have to leave and come back. Don't tell me I'm shit out of luck. Time we're gonna go into the pause screen and equip arrows. Because that's one thing I forgot my first attempt here. Um, the fact that you can use arrows. Um. Wait, it is my loss. Sheave your weapon. I'm not, I'm not using the sword. I command the Akana army of the Akana kingdom atop the hill. I'm, I'm Skull Kida. 
since being shamed and lost by my battle with my kingdom, I have waited here for one to come and awaken my soul. Young swordsman who has awakened and deathly defeated me, I shall rely on your power to fulfill my request. I ask that you take my soul, which rests in the fiery burning flame, and convey my words to my men, even in death remain loyal to me. Tell them the war has ended. Then I should be able to drift quietly into sleep. Wait, I, I just made... <laughs> Goron Link's derpy face. I just made a realization. Um, there's multiple different, like... Things you can do... On... In the graveyard. And the thing that I wanna do, I think is day one only. Also, nice menu sound for that. Um, you can get that, it's just I need bunny hood and I didn't use it. Actually, no, you know what? That's even easier, I think. Right? Because, you know, you have taller legs. I think I need the bunny hood. I think the the main objective of this area is day one only. And if that's the case, I have to waste a cycle. Doing absolutely big golf. Which sucks. Oh, and you know what doubly sucks? I need a red potion for an NPC. Yeah, this is super embarrassing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's not even night time, meaning I can't do this right now. The fact that I didn't finish uh, Snowhead on day one is screwing everything else up now. Um, I need to go back to Clock Town and do bomb jumps again with the red potion. Unless we get to your day two Clock Town. while that you need a powder kit to do this. So regular bombs to do it. 
So I'm gonna test this theory. Once and for all. This is a personal, mental thing that I've been dealing with for like, I don't think years, but... Wait a minute, it did. Oh my god, it did. It did it. It did it. Is it 20 rupees? Oh, well, that's a new item. We technically didn't have bomb juice yet. When you actually don't need bomb juice until not even fourth dungeon, you need them literally at the end of the game. Um. I do have a theory if uh, things go right. Yeah, uh... <laughs> go around like eyes. And remember, I have to do this because Snowhead screwed me up. Now we're going to need the uh, Lens of Truth and the Red Potion. Oh, don't tell me that. I'm shocked you're the first person who's spoken to me. I've been here for many years, waving my arms and asking for help. If everyone ignores and passes by me, it's about as impressive as so I'm getting used to it. I have a request to you. Oh, uh, is that it? Feel better, I think. Thanks, ghost. Gratitude. Let's go there. Now let me put this down here. Tyra, the stone soldier, is actually nothing. Um. So now we have the stone mask. Which is going to make Great Bay way easier. This is specifically what I wanted. Um, you can actually get further in Ikana. You can actually get all the way to the temple. And you can beat the temple. Um, except, uh, you need a Pona. <laughs> like, you need, need a Pona. So. Oof. Hey, okay, at least I got the owl sashi, so I don't have to do that bomb jump thing ever again for Great Bay, at least. And I don't think I ever want to go back to Akana. At least for right now. Oh, and before I forget, get the box. Let's do it. This one specifically reveals a secret passage. And the best song in the game. Oh shit. 
I thought they wouldn't see me. What I get to try to be fast in the stealth section. So they don't even cover up the hole still here. If you hold the shield button, you get this um, energy wave. You can use it to damage enemies while swimming, which is really cool. Come on. Now, if you had a map from Tingle, it would actually tell you uh, when the um, Gerudo uh, guards are coming. But obviously I don't have that map, so I just have to watch very closely. Now, here's the problem. Uh, the main mission here is to get the Zora eggs. There's four in here, and each one requires a bottle. Um, however, if you look at my inventory, yeah, um, that's missing Romani Ranch. That's why Romani Ranch was so important. That's why I was stressing so much about it. It's also why Melt Road, um, the owl statue is the most important owl statue in the whole game. So that's been pretty smooth one. Swimming in this game takes practice. But once you get it, you get it. Now, the reason why I'm in here without the four bottles is because, um, Because there's actually another item here besides the uh, Zora eggs that's gonna be that's gonna make everything else so much easier. And also there's heart piece here, so gotta get that. Out. Oh yeah, I have to switch the heart pieces in this pile of barrels. I just missed it. Again, I'm used to having my transformation masks on X. If I have them on R, I'm just gonna have So if you hold B, you can aim with the boomerangs. I didn't even realize I didn't mention that. But usually the boomerang is just a separate item you get. But in this game, it's just a part of your moveset, which is pretty cool. No! No! 
Do Akana because Snowhead messed me up so badly. get the item that I want to get. Okay. So this is where the stone mask comes in handy, because the stone mask makes you invisible to all enemies. Now, um, cool thing about that is that it also works on the guards. Uh, no, actually, I want the picture box still on. Yep, so stone mask on. Nobody's going to pay attention to me because I'm a dumb rock. And snap the photo. Now, you may think I may have done that for a gag. That's not a gag that I did. I'm not trying to, like, make this weird. That's an actual side quest. For, like, an... Not, not, not a side quest. Um, this is a main quest thing. Like, you need to take a picture of that Gerudo. Well, I guess you can technically do it without it, but... It's really hard, and there's no way a casual person would know unless they use a guide. So yeah, taking a picture of that Gerudo... ...is actually the best possible way to, um, progress. I've been waiting for you. And did you find the rest of the eggs? No, but that's because... What are you trying to pull here? If people hear the great pirates have lost the treasure they stole, we'll become the laughing stock. Yes, but, Avail, the sea is strangely murky where we attack by sea snakes. Silence. That's why the Zors can't send for any help. Now that the eggs are gone, the Zoras should be frantically searching for them. 
we don't hurry, the Zoras will get to them before we do. There are four eggs here now. Hurry, go find the other three eggs before the, before the sea snakes eat them. Understood. Wait. The Zora eggs are the only clue that we have about that dragon cloud floating over the bay. If what that strange masked one says is true, we can get our hands on the treasure that lies sleeping in the temple in that dragon cloud. And we can spend the rest of our lives living the good life. And so get a move on and go find them. Now. Uh, sorry to intrude, ladies, but, um, do you like these? More, more importantly, do you like jazz? On, we gotta jump off. In this chest. Oh my god, I've been waiting for this item because so much is gonna open up to us. You found the hookshot. Use it to grapple items so you can reel them in or pull yourself over to them. Use C to arm it, and use the control stick and C to shoot. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you all later. Uh, this has been me playing The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, looking like a dumb rock.